Hello, my name is Mrigank. And I'm Nikita. And we've been engaged now for over a year. A year and a half almost. A year and a half. And we're planning our wedding in November. Um, and we're very, very excited. Come on. <laughs> so we both live in the UK. And uh, we're both from Indian families with parents who've kept us grounded and kept us involved with our culture but it's still very different to us to be planning an Indian wedding um, which will take place in India where there's so many things that we don't know about and so when I heard about the concept of the wedding book by Family Script I thought it was a really wonderful idea because it would really help us to understand our culture better the different traditions that we have involved in weddings and most importantly to get to know each other's families um, before the marriage. Planning a we wedding can be such a roller coaster. You're getting to know not only a new well, I've known Ragan for a while, but you're not only getting to know him more, but getting to know his family, and not just his parents, his immediate family, but the extended family. Along with our family trees, um, there's something called a migration map in the book, which tells the story of both of our parents. It's for my side, where they studied in India, when they moved to the UK, um, and it brings me closer to both of them and, and helps me to understand the position that I'm in now and the things that they've had to, to do to sacrifice for us to be here. Um, and I know it's the same for you. So, for example, in my, in my family, my dad travelled through a number of countries before he came to the UK and I'd always had stories about them but I'd never seen photos um, and I'd never seen any of his childhood photos so it was just, it was so fun to see pictures of him as a child. Yeah, things that he would never show you voluntarily. Yeah, no, no. Um, to dig up those old photos, to learn more about where he'd lived um, and what he'd done in, in the different countries that he'd been to. And the one other section that we really, really liked from this book, uh, there's a section called Words of Wisdom. Um, so in my family in particular, our grandparents are the most important people. So they are at the head of the whole family. And my Nanaji and Nani are very close to me. I've been with them from day one of my life. Especially Nanaji, both of them have written wonderful letters and they've reflected on some really touching memories of when I was a little boy and the memories they have shared with me. And both of them have welcomed Nikita with those words, things that perhaps they wouldn't get the chance to say, sit down and say, because there's so much going on at the wedding, there's no real time to welcome her like that. It's, it's also difficult to express it in words sometimes. So to have a letter written from Nanaji and Naniji uh, in a book which welcomes me to the families, it's so, it's so beautiful and so touching. And it's lovely that we can keep that letter forever through the book. Through the book, yeah. It's something that's permanent. It'll always be there with us. Everything we've discussed has gone into this book. It covers so much uh, of our history, family history, emotion, excitement of the wedding. And when we initially were starting the process, I thought personally that it would be so much information and how would the, they manage to produce something like this. But it's really been plain sailing. There's They've, the team has been so accommodating, they made everything so straightforward, um, put it together in such a beautiful format, um, something that we can treasure forever. And every, no detail is too big or too small for them, even from the cover of the book it has mm. pictures of London where we first met, uh, through to pictures of Motihari, Delhi, um, it's really really good, uh, the attention to detail is amazing, the concept is fabulous and the end product is really wonderful, something we'll keep in our house. Uh, forever. So thank you.